What it do, everybody? Back at you one more time. One more again. Here we go. What it do? I got a new video today. Um, just adding something out to my motorcycle along with all the other videos. So go back and watch all the other videos so you can see all the stuff I'm already doing. Uh, yeah, it's hot up in here. But uh, we're going to go ahead and get through this. Uh, the first thing we're going to do is I'm going to show you where I got the product from, uh, their website, and uh, just show you show you how they come in the packages and what you could do with them. Right now, we're gonna go ahead and uh, get started. First of all, I'll go ahead and subscribe, like, comment. Uh, please subscribe so we can keep growing. Uh, first of all, here is the uh, motorcycle swap meet. Uh, I'm in California, and this one's at, uh, as you can see there, the Long Beach Veterans Stadium. It's been going on for years. These are just the un upcoming dates. Uh, same thing back and forth. You can see a lot of good vendors. Please go out there and support. Uh, we got a lot of people out there that are uh, doing the Rona, do need help, and all the best way to help is just contribute. Uh, one of the companies that I found there was uh, twowheelride.com. Twowheelride.com. And this is their products. They have a flipper, which is a cruise control assist. And uh, actually, this part flips down when you're not using it. And I'll show you guys how that works. And the cruise control. My road glide has cruise control, but I'm going to use the flipper on my road glide and on my road king. I'm going to show you guys how we go ahead and mount the actual crew, uh, go cruise control. Uh, all right, so this is the this is the flipper that I chose. They have different ones. Uh, mine just happens to say uh, Route 66. They got an American flag uh, and a bunch of other little stuff on there. Uh, this is the way it comes. As you can tell, it goes onto your. Uh, a throttle control or uh, the handle and I'll show you how that goes on there uh, it comes with an extra rubber little pizze whizze I don't know what the hell it's called but that's the part that goes in there and that helps tying up to the actual throttle body oh. let's see here we go what it do and that's the for the cruise control I guess they have a patent protected on the on, on it uh, it's made of a uh, 6061 aluminum alloy, CNC'd, so you know it's good quality. And back here is just the instructions, so you know you do get instructions with it. Uh, a lot of companies don't even give instructions anymore, but it tells you what to do and everything on there. And there's a website. I haven't gone on it, which I don't think I need to see how they actually do it. More of a product review. All right, so this here is the actual cruise control. You know, CNC aluminum. This is the part that goes on your handlebar, and this is for you to tighten it down on the actual bar. Uh, it does come with these grommets, and again, these go on the actual handlebar. Uh, again, just uh, shouting out their website. You see that for the flipper, there's different ones. I have the Route 66, and this is the United States flag, and that's what we you go there again for the website. Uh, again, you get instructions for everything. It's a grow cruise control to throttle body control. And of course, 6061 aluminum alloy. And in the back, some good instructions. All this stuff could be found at the swap meet if you want to go in person to check them out. Or you can go online and pick one up. Hopefully, after this video, you know exactly how it works and you can go ahead and support. Right, so here we're at my bro glide. Uh, I'm gonna give you a little look at it. Oh, yeah, please subscribe, check out the other videos, see if my other videos are helpful, share them. Uh, you know, help us grow, come with us on our journey. I uh, just see the seat, tour pack, all the stuff, windshield. Uh, I do have the rims coming, powder coat, they're on their way. Uh, they should be finished this week. Uh, you can see I put the intake on there. I did a couple of little stuff, but it's pretty clean. Let's give you a little view. I like looking at it myself. Any chance I get. Oh, yeah. It's a nice one. Nice. I can't wait to get back on the road. Please subscribe, comment, share. Let everybody know they could come along the journey with us to grow. Now, like every product, no matter what, you always got to know is what it do. So this is it here and it goes right on your handlebar now my grips are pretty wide 
This is the piece that comes inside of there to help tighten things up. It doesn't look like I'm gonna need it because mine's wide enough. So this basically goes on the end. You see there, there's some screws, some screws, and that just helps you tighten up. So how this, how this works is once it's on there tight, instead of just hitting the throttle and having to hold it the whole time, you could just lay your hand on there. So you could just lay your hand on here and push down with your hand instead of having to hold the grip the whole time. Especially for maybe older riders, you know, like corporal tunnel and stuff. But man, this thing, this little thing is awesome. I like it. And it just goes right there. Boom. You lean your hand on it. Boom, obviously this is my wrong hand, so it'd be this one here. And you push down on it. Now the good thing about this is when you when you when you don't want to use it. Oh man, they busting. The good thing is when you don't want to use it, you could just flip this to the side. Bam, and it's out of your way. And it just sits there. When you when you need it, you go ahead and put it back. This is a pretty awesome little tool. Um, I haven't used it yet. I will do a ride along when I do have it on. But I don't see no no issue with it. It just ties on there and you push it down with your wrist. Now let's go ahead and do the uh, the cruise control. Like I said, my bike has cruise control. So I don't need to use it. But I'm, I did buy the product, the support. And I hope all y'all support, comment, subscribe, share. That we could come bring you more videos. I have new equipment coming along, new video cameras, uh, new new writing footage is going to be coming out, and I'm getting used to being in front of the camera. I'm not the cat that uh, likes being in front of the camera, but uh, in order to explain stuff, I do got to get more familiar. I got to get a little more adjusted to being in front of the camera. So, bam, that was enough. Oh, look at that bike. So now I'm gonna show you on my Road King how the cruise control works. All right, so here's my Road King. Uh, it's a 98 police bike. Uh, still working on it. Uh, I'm not a mechanic, but I do try to do everything myself first before I get somebody. And it's just been, I don't know if y'all went through the same problems, but it's hard to get a, a mechanic at a shop because usually they have their own little crews and there's people they work with you know understandable but i'm trying to get in if y'all know anybody drop me in the comments or shout out to built by dre uh shout out to built by dre he has a channel uh kicks by dre and uh, he's a mechanic i did email him but i'll uh, leave him some comments tell him to hit me back up uh, what did it do so i could get some help from him so now i'm going to show you don't want to drag this video on on how the cruise control works all right so again this is the throttle this slides on there and you could open it and close it here there we go wasn't sure so once it's on there you could tighten it up And it just uh, sits there. I'm sorry you can't see it too good, but I'm up on the wall. I should have took it down. What did it do? There we go. It just sits there. So now as you throttle through, you throttle back. And you push it forward as you're rolling. And that's going to hold it there. So now, let's see if I get a good look at it. So it just sits there. It's actually being held by the brake lever. Now, as you're riding, anytime you could just roll it back and it'll, un it'll unhook. Or you can loosen it and it'll just be loose. But basically, that's how it works. It just holds the throttle at whatever position you have it. You tighten it, which you could be pre tightened before that. And it just holds there by the lever. It works pretty good. I've used it another bike, just not my Roll King. All right, so that's the piece there. Go cruise. For bikes that don't have cruise control. And the other part, which I'm keeping on here, it's the 
looked out of control. And again, it flips up. Easy, super easy. All right, so just uh, one more time. Toolworldride.com. Uh, that's the person that I met at the swap meet. And that's their products. Awesome products. I'm not sponsored or nothing. As you can see, I have like no subscribers. So how <laughs> would they sponsor me? But uh, that's pretty much it for this video. Uh, go ahead, subscribe, comment, and uh, watch my other videos for anything else you want to see that I've done on my road glide. And, uh, you know, we'll keep you in touch. Please stay tuned.